Hey guys, what's up? So we're just gonna get a copy clipboard manager, guys, and this is really cool. I'm gonna show you two tweets, and yeah, let's begin with the video. So two sources you want to add is a package source, is the source right there. You guys see package, and the Nepita, Nepita source, guys. Um, one of that source too. So you can pause the video, add those two sources, and once you guys add those two sources, I'm gonna show you two different tweets. So you can download one, download both, depending on which one you like. They both do the same thing. One of them does cost money. I'm gonna show you guys a free one first. It's called a copy pasta, and this is from the Nepitas, Nepita source, whatever is how you want to pronounce it. And you guys go follow him on Twitter. That's his link right there. You just tap on it right there and you can follow him. But we want to scroll down and we do have um what the tweet looks like. So basically I'm just gonna do the screenshots. I'm gonna I ask you to install these tweets so I can show you. Um basically it just like keeps like a they both just keep a manager on a like kinda like a clipboard history of what you copy and you can delete it or not. So you copy a lot of things, they'll all be there. So it's just pretty cool if you copy a lot of things for like videos or copy a lot of things and send it to people and let's like, say like you just buy it and you you copy something else and like oh man I just forgot about it or I I just messed it up, I forgot what I copied, I can't get it back. This basically stores everything you copy. Or let's say you just want to copy like a password for a little bit. We use it for many uses. I mean, it just basically uh, has like a manager for what you copy. So I think it's pretty cool. Um, I'm going to show you guys the tweak. But before I do that, I'm going to show you the other one. The other one is called Copy Log. And this is from the package source. And those cost $2.99. It's definitely worth it. So how you guys want to actually purchase this tweak? You want to scroll all the way down. And you guys see this stuff down here. And you tap on um, account. Or you want to tap on log in. And you guys see create account. Which really, it takes like a minute. Not even a create account. And then you just pay. You just basically from there you guys cannot install this unless you pay for it it's 199 and honestly in my opinion it's definitely worth it it's an amazing tweak they both do the same thing but they're both a little different i'm gonna show you guys exactly what each one does all right so once you install the tweet you have to go to your settings and scroll down to your tweet section and you see the both right there. there's copy log and there's copy pasta and we're gonna start with copy pasta which is the free one first enable it and you can change the placement of it so i don't know why it's like that but you would have to be inside application for it to work so mine's on dictation, so you're on the bottom right, I just uh, tap on that and it'll come up. But like I said, you also could do um, different um, placements. So I'm gonna do on bottom, on bottom I don't do on bottom my iPhone X because I have like, that's how I pull up my home screen. I mean, I pull up my, uh, my tab switcher. So that's why I don't do it on my bottom screen. And I can do it on my top, but then it gets in the way of like my word suggestion. So I'm gonna show you, you have to open up an app. So I'm just gonna open up messages. And this is, I'm sending a message to myself. You see it's right there, it's like a little glitchy. Um, I don't know why it's like that. Let me type something. There we go. See, it's like that. But then, like, it's, like, kind of, like, it cuts off your keyboard and stuff. So, I don't like it up there. But then, if I do bottom, bottom, no push, basically, it kind of cuts off your words. It's not going to push it to the bottom. So, now, when we actually go to messages, you can see that it's kind of, like, it gets in the way a little. Because, like, if you have words on there, like, it's going to get in the way. Um, if you go to bottom, uh, yeah, bottom by itself, it'll push it on the bottom. So, now, we can go to the bottom. Now, it's down there. So, um, yeah, basically, you just we do dictation, which I like dictation the best. So, you just go to dictation. But I'm going to show you. I might call my screen recorder, so I'm just going to show you the same way. But, um, basically, you just type something, and then you can actually just uh, select all, tap on copy, and then when you tap on it, you can see that. It's from messages, and it's right there, and you just tap on it, and there you go. You have, like, multiple ones. Also, if, like, let's say you don't want it there anymore, you just swipe from the um, right to left, and you get to tap on favor if you want or delete it. And there you go. So that's basically how that works. You copy lanes, copy anything, and it'll work. And you just tap on the bottom, tap on the top, like the arrow to get it like out of your way and stuff like that. And then the other one, the other tweak is the copy log. And this tweak is basically you want to enable it. And when you do anything with this tweak, you can just tap on respring to on um, for the effect, for the change to take effect for the copy pasta. You literally just um change it and it'll work right away. Um. So now we go to uh, copy log. Okay, so um, you want to make sure it's enabled, and these are just like different keyboards you can press around with or whatever. How you enable it? So basically, how it would enable it. Um, also follow the creator on Twitter, guys. Shout out to him. He's an amazing developer. He developed this tweak as Nepita. So credit goes to both of them. I'll have both their Twitter links down in the description. You guys just check them out. So basically, for this one, you have to do anywhere. So I'm just gonna do like my messages again. Okay, so um, basically, all right. So basically, how you guys want to do this one is as you want to press it. And you see this button, it says copy log. So like when you like copy, paste, and like when you select all, you can see if you um you, if you get this menu, you just tap on the arrow pointing right, and there's be on the, always at the end it'll be copy log. So copy log, you just tap on it, and this it'll bring it up. See that's why I copied before. So you just hold on to it and you can tap on remove, just the same way. So I'm gonna do a random message, I'm gonna select all, I'm gonna copy it, and then I'm going to tap it again, tap on copy log. And then, I don't know why it didn't pop up. I mean, sometimes, like, rarely it doesn't pop up. But most of the time, it does pop up. So, I'm going to try that one more time. And it popped up. You got, like, you got multiple ones, like I said, with the other tweak. 
Um, this this one also works. It's just this one costs money, but like you know, it's two dollars. I think it's definitely worth it. And I like, the only thing like about this one I don't like about the other one is that let's say you if you have a link, you actually can hold on to it, or I mean just tap on it, and it'll actually like load up the um the link like right there and then. Just, so like you copy different links like with, you can't see with like exactly what links are what which ones which. I'm like so with this tweak when you actually go over to copy log, you just tap on it and then actually load like the little image right here on the screen. Of like what that um tweak what that link would bring you to so that's the only reason why I like that one this one a little more but I do like the other, I think the other one's more easy to access you guys thanks for watching I'll catch you guys in my next video like comment subscribe and peace.